Welcome to Telugu One Academy. In today's class, we will see transportation of Andhra Pradesh. What modes of transportation Andhra Pradesh do do have? The state of Andhra Pradesh do have what kinds of transportations? So, uh, transportations and a mana uh, like means of modes of transport. So, what do you think by transportation? Anything, uh, services or people or anyone traveling from one place to another is called transport or transportation. Transportation actually is a lifeline for any economy in every economy. So without transportation, there is no development at all. We cannot even uh, expect any development. Transportation and communication are elanti segments and sectors. As Irendu, Oka economy, Oka state, Nigani, Oka country, Nigani, then a face in March is sign matter. Either developed in a extremely developed in a chase thai, unte, lake pote, palu, disconnected with the whole society and matter. So, if coming to Andhra Pradesh, so what kind of modes of transport we do have? See, Manchuskuna to transport or transportation is the movement of humans. Animals, goods from one location to another. This is the lifeline for any economy. A economy, a sector, uh, develop a valley. First, this is the first thing that we have to do. Even industrialization develop a valley, first, we have to do transportation. So, our state. A state is not developed, but in the state of transportation and infrastructure, lo, the development is very important. So, uh, modes of transport lo manki inni rakha lo na ente, okuti, uh, roadways, roadways lo manki emos ente, road and rail, rendo osthai. Next is airways, waterways and pipelines and space and matter. So, ante e lo manki ente include othai ente, air, land, adhi anku na unkada land lo ni rail and road and matter. And water, waterways, cable, pipeline and space. Of course, space transportation and now we are not so much and inka satellites tappa humans inka space lo ni frequent ga travel chese anta technology ipppidik inka raal edu. Future it's coming, we can expect even that too. So, Andhra Pradesh lo koste, coming to now roadways. Roadways, road ravana samstha. And a and uh, anything which travels on road. Adhi buses hai na vehicles hai na or Railways and rail in our virtue. E transportation slow roadways loni. We do have two types of transportations and matter. To basically, if manu render divisions kita this kunde, we do have two types. One is public sector transportation and private. Ante you have equal public sector ante it's run by government or any public organizations. Private ante personal vehicles and matter. Like every single person having their own vehicle and matter. So, in this public sector transportation mode, we do have uh, roadways loni. according to Nagpur road plan. According to Nagpur road plan 1943, what happened now? At the time of when the British India, British India wala control lo unde tapdu, 1943 loni Nagpur road plan prakaro, Britishers have decided there should be five types of mainly four and others like five types of uh, road transportations. Avi end and day national highways, state highways, district highways, or, uh, rural highways or panchayat highways or other district highways and matter. Even after independence also, we are following these types of types of roads and matter. Even after 1947 Tarvata Koda, this Nagpur plan de mano follow chest no. Ante every state in the country, every state in India has all these types of roads, all these major types of roads like national highways, state highways, district roads, and panchayat or rural roads. And coming to next point is that. Apart from all these highways, national highways ne manu NH, NH sunny unto unta. Ha, state highways SH. So, apart from all this, even we do have recent development in NT, we do have another types of highways also. Vatine manu 
ah lantau an mata intento ah ah ante ade asian highways an mata this is a uh, new development asian highways ante like further as the class proceeds further i'll explain you in detail as for now just listen to this okay so if coming to transportation again uh, uh, we have seen we do have air land and road so what is the fastest mode of transport air is the fastest mode of transport and costliest and luxurious okay everybody knows that air tra uh, air travel uh, shortest shortest in the sense meeru uh, 24 hours lo or 32 hours lo travel cheyals in a place ni it will take you in 2 hours so airways this is a shortest mode of transport shortest dis cover, distance covered in a very short time and next is the uh, costliest and matter so obviously when distance reduces money increases okay price increases next is road and rail transport when we come to road and rail transport these are the most used popular transports so everybody uses roadways like buses cars or whatever so road and rail transports are more popular transport so uh, but rail transports are in the hands of central government not in the state government so rail transport is also very huge in india so uh, largest number of employees are there uh, in indian railways work in work for indian railways and water transport like it can be both sea uh, sea water transport or inland water transport so it is the cheapest and slowest mode of transport and it will take so many months if we travel through water edaina car ho gaani lapte edaina mano parcel gaani techukoli appi maname travel cheyali ante so it will take uh, so much time but very cheap anamata so manakuni transports loni ekku most popular and most used transport and most uh, uh, reachable to every uh, single human being almost to every single human being is road Uh, almost india lo prathi nuke and corner lo prathi nuke and corner lo ni maniki road facilities unne even highest peaks like maniki uh, andhra lo chusukunte arku valley inka atu paina uh, inka uh, valleys lo unde chinna chinna interior places lo lambasing ilanti vaati kuda manu road transport lo happy ga velthunnam anamata so again coming to uh, highways roadways anamata so uh, highways are maintained by nhai nhai national ante national highways authority of india national highways authority of india so nh ai full form anamata so all the national idi uh, idi states lo nunchi run avutayi gaani but they are developed and maintained by national nh ai in between ppp mode lo kuda majlo toll gates avi teesi vere ppp mode lo kuda maintain chestu untar but dan authority evarante nh ai anamata state highways are exclusively maintained by state government uh, state highways lage district roads and even panchayat or rural roads district roads ante state highways ante prati uh, district headquarters nunchi state ki state lo prati district headquarters ki connect chesed anamata and next is panchal panchayat and rural roads these are the most used uh, uh, used roads of state ante mana andhra pradesh state ki vaste ekkuva of uh, ekko use chesedi రోడ్స్ ఏమంటే పంచాయత్ అండ్ రూరల్ రోడ్స్ అనమాట మోస్ట్ కమర్షియల్ హైవేస్ రోడ్స్ ఏమంటే నేషనల్ హైవేస్ అనమాట నేషనల్ హైవేస్ ఆర్ కమర్షియల్లీ ద మోస్ట్ కమర్షియల్ అండ్ మోస్ట్ యూజ్డ్ రోడ్స్ ఆర్ పంచాయత్ అండ్ రూరల్ రోడ్స్ నెక్స్ట్ కమ్స్ ఇస్ 
ఈవెన్ డిస్ట్రిక్ట్ రోడ్స్ నేషనల్ హైవేస్ ఎందుకు మోస్ట్ కమర్షియల్స్ అంటే లైక్ యూ నో దాట్ అక్కడ ప్రతి చోట హైవే అంటే నీడ్స్ ఎక్కువ ఉంటాయి ట్రాన్స్పోర్టేషన్ ఎక్కువ ఉంటుంది వేరే స్టేట్స్ నుంచి వచ్చేవాళ్ళు ఆ ట్రావెల్ చేసేవాళ్ళు రకరకాల పనులతో ఉంటాయి అనమాట సో వెన్ కమింగ్ టు ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ వీ డూ హ్యావ్ ద అంటే స్టేట్ రోడ్స్ ఆర్ మెయింటైన్ బై ఆర్ఎన్బి రోడ్స్ అండ్ బిల్డింగ్ డెవలప్మెంట్ అనమాట ఆర్ఎన్బి అంటే రోడ్స్ అండ్ బిల్డింగ్ డెవలప్మెంట్ so the total rnb road network excluding not including ante national highways kaakunda only mana state highways district and panchayat highways ive enta uh, in andhra pradesh state december 2020 as on december ante we can take it as a latest uh, report because this is the uh, latest available report as on december 2020 the road network Oh, every road network excluding apart from national highways ap has nearly 46225 kilometers of road network we do have nearly 46225 kilometers of road network excluding apart from national highways so comprising in that in this 46225 kilometers of the road network 13500 kilometers of state highways state highways comprise comprise 13500 kilometers and other like remaining 32725 kilometers or of major district roads and rural roads major district and rural roads comprise of 32725 kilometers means state exclusive our state network uh, state road network we do have 46225 kilometers of road network and next the density of national highways in andhra pradesh density ante sandrata ante Uh, how how many national highways we do have in a particular for 1 lakh population for 1 lakh population how many national highways andhra pradesh state do have ante like we do have nearly 13.72 kilometers the density of national highways is 13.72 kilometers per 1 lakh people per 1 lakh people ante 1 lakh mandi ki 13.72 పాయింట్ సెవెన్ టూ కిలోమీటర్స్ రోడ్ ఉందన్నమాట దిస్ ఈస్ అకార్డింగ్ టు టూ థౌజండ్ లెవెన్ అది నేషనల్ యావరేజ్ తీసుకుంటే వెన్ వీ టేక్ ద నేషనల్ యావరేజ్ విత్ ద డెన్సిటీ నేషనల్ యావరేజ్ ఈజ్ ఓన్లీ టెన్ పాయింట్ ఎయిట్ నైన్ కిలోమీటర్స్ అండ్ ఆంధ్రప్రదేశ్ నేషనల్ హైవేస్ డెన్సిటీ ఈజ్ థర్టీన్ పాయింట్ సెవెన్ టూ కిలోమీటర్స్ ఇట్స్ అగేన్స్ట్ నేషనల్ హైవేస్ డెన్సిటీ సో uh even if you take in this case we are leading than the we are higher than the we are above than the national average density uh, in national highways so in terms of area coverage a length of 41.46 kilometers is available for every 1000 square kilometers for every 1000 square kilometers means how much stretch it has to have how much area these road networks do cover I means it takes is it a, a very it does have a uh, so much of differences between two roads or not so much of difference not of much difference so if we take that for every 1000 square kilometers we do have 41.46 kilometers for every uh, 1000 square kilometers 41.46 kilometers of road network is available so in the state as against even all in the average is 40 40 kilometers per 1000 square kilometers even we are ahead of the national average in coverage also in terms of coverage and in terms of uh, density we are again we are ahead of the national average so when coming to Uh, state of andhra pradesh how many national highways we do have we have 38 national highways 
we the how means don't go with the diagram this is more or less the reason representation of ap so uh, this is the, the map of andhra pradesh roughly so we do have total 38 national highways means running all over ap some are like this some are like this some are like this so like this 38 national highways run over the state of Andhra Pradesh. We do have 38 national highways. They cover the length of 6,943 kilometers. How much? 6,943.69 kilometers. So out of this, a total length of 2,525.15 kilometers under the control of NHAI. We have seen uh, earlier NHA, National Highways Authority of India. They they control 2,000 nearly 2,525 kilometers uh, of national highways, and other or under like 833.2 kilometers with the Ministry of Road Transport and Highways (PIU) and 3586. Under the control of state PW. Here only state controls 3,586 maintains it control in the sense it maintains whatever it is so we andhra pradesh do have 38 national highways at the length uh, which cover covering a length of 3943 kilometers right um, how much in percentage if we this is the accurate numbers if we take it in the percentage how much percent uh, they do occupy Again, coming to state highways. State highways account for 29% of the total roads in the state. State highways account for only 29%. That is 14,772 kilometers. State highways account for 14,772 kilometers. That is, it comes around nearly 29%. Means others are national highways, district roads, and panchayat and rural panchayat or rural roads. So state highway. So coming to state highway again, which is the uh, longest highway. Means which state highway is the longest, stretching starting from here to from end, ending here. Means starting somewhere from here traveling here or whatever so which is the longest state highway is state highway number 31 sh 31 which runs from renigunta to muddanuru ante renigunta nunchi muddanuru vela state highway sh 31 adi ati podavaina um, state highway anamata ante andhra pradesh rashtram lo ye state highway ati podavaina ante sh 31 the number Every highway does have numbers and matter. Every road does have numbers. National highways ki, state highways ki, or AH ski. Miru road mein a wealth unte, uh, akada hoardings sign a miru chudachu. Uh, what do you say, like uh, NH16 or NH45, AH1 or SH31, chinna pedaga, blue low, green low, red low, ilaga boards, uh, hoardings can be stunte, right and left low. So they mention, and we are in that particular uh, road. So uh, longest state highway in Andhra Pradesh is SH 31. That runs from Renigunta to Muddanur. Which place? Renigunta ninchi Muddanur varku velle state highway 31. Ati padavai na state highway. So coming to panchayats. And the panchayat has engineering department. The total length of rural roads as on 1 4 2020 in the state is 79,636 kilometers. By seeing this number, you can understand uh, like almost 60% of roads are under panchayat. These are the highly used roads. 
सो अंदर दीज आर पंचायत रोड्स और रूरल रोड्स दे डू हैव अ लेंथ ऑफ नियरली सेवेंटी नाइन थो नियरली एटी थाउजेंड यू कैन टेक और अराउंड फिगर फॉर रिमेम्बरेंस सेवेंटी नाइन थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड थर्टी सिक्स किलोमीटर्स ऑफ रोड नेटवर्क ओल एक्सक्लूसिव पंचायत एंड रूरल रोड्स टू हैव द रोड नेटवर्क ऑफ द स्टेट इज मेंटेन बाय आंध्र प्रदेश रोड डेवलपमेंट कॉर्पोरेशन अंडर द रोड्स एंड बिल्डिंग्स डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ द स्टेट सो दिस रोड नेटवर्क इज मेंटेन और रन बाय और रिस्पॉन्स विच ऑर्गेनाइज इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल मीन्स आंध्र प्रदेश रोड डेवलपमेंट कॉर्पोरेशन ए पी आर डी सी दिस इज कॉल्ड ए पी आर डी सी ए पी आर डी सी अंडर दी आर एन बी डिपार्टमेंट अंडर बिच डिपार्टमेंट ए पी आर डी सी कम्स अंडर दी आर एन बी डिपार्टमेंट सो दिस इज अबाउट आर हाईवेज एंड ऑल इन डेप्थ विल सी नाउ कमिंग टू National Highway. So, uh, how many national highways do run? We have seen thirty-eight national highways run in the state of Andhra Pradesh. So, which is the longest national highway, and which it runs from which place to which place? So, National Highway sixteen, that is called as NH sixteen. NH sixteen is the Longest national highway with a length of nearly thousand twenty four kilometers in AP, exclusively in AP, it does covers thousand twenty four kilometers and runs from Shrikakulam district to Nello district. It runs from Shrikakulam district to Nello district. Earlier national highway sixteen uh, was called used to be called as NH five. NH five. NH five was the first one name for National Highway sixteen. Uh, recently, I mean recently in the sense like nearly five six years ago, they have changed all the numbers of the National Highways. So NH don't get confused. NH five or NH sixteen both are same, but the new nomenclature or new number is NH sixteen. This is the Longest, longest national highway in our state, in state of Andhra Pradesh, which covers thousand twenty four kilometers. Okay, so uh, it covers uh, through how many districts? Almost all the districts. It it travels uh, through the coast coast of the Andhra Pradesh. so it almost runs from actually it starts from kolkata in west bengal so it travels almost the through uh, towards the to uh, all together parallel to the coast of andhra pradesh starting from shrikakulam to tada in nellore tada in nello district so it covers almost shrikakulam district vijayanagaram district visakhapatnam uh, next west goda east godavari west godavari uh, krishna guntur ongol sorry prakasam and nello district almost all the states all the districts of coastal districts of andhra pradesh this is the longest highway uh, cr uh, running over running through and state of andhra pradesh that is national highway 16 or 5 old number is 5 the new number is 16 it travels through which major cities okay it it uh, it runs over, uh, runs through all these districts of coastal districts of andhra pradesh it runs through which uh, major cities of andhra pradesh like from ichhapuram next vijayanagaram visakhapatnam 
नेक्स्ट कम्स एलूर राजमंड्री एलूर एंड विजयवाड़ा गुंटूर ओंगोल एंड नेक्स्ट तड़ा ओके तड़ा इज दी एंडिंग पॉइंट फॉर दिस मींस इन इन आंध्र बॉर्डर तड़ा इज नेलूर डिस्ट्रिक्ट विच इज इन द आंध्र बॉर्डर इच्छापुरम सी इच्छापुरम श्रीकाकुम विजयनगर वैजाग् एलूर विजयवाड़ा गुंटूर ओंगोल नेलूर गूडूर एंड तड़ा सो दिस इज दी लॉन्गेस्ट हाईवे इन आंध्र प्रदेश सो दिस इज अ पार्ट ऑफ नेशनल हाईवे सिक्सटीन ऑफ फाइव इज अ पार्ट ऑफ गोल्ड गोल्ड एंड क्वाडिलेटरल प्रोग्राम सो वॉट इज विच वॉज स्टार्टेड इन टू थाउजेंड टू थाउजेंड वन बाई दी देन प्राइम मिनिस्टर श्री अटल बिहारी वाजपेयी जी सो वॉट इज दिस गोल्ड एंड क्वाडिलेटरल प्रोग्राम सी गोल्डन द आइडिया ऑफ दी देन प्राइम मिनिस्टर अटल बिहारी श्री अटल बिहारी वाजपेयी वॉज दैट टू इंटर कनेक्ट और कनेक्ट ऑल द मेजर मेट्रोपोलिटन सिटीज ऑफ इंडिया लाइक सी क्वाडिलेटर मीन्स समथिंग लाइक दिस ओके सो द आइडिया वॉज टू कनेक्ट ऑल द मेजर मेट्रोपोलिटन सिटीज ऑल द मेजर सिटीज फ्रॉम नॉर्थ साउथ ईस्ट वेस्ट लाइक कनेक्टिंग दिल्ली कोलकाता चेन्नई एंड मुंबई सो नेशनल हाईवे सिक्सटी इज अ पार्ट ऑफ गोल्डन क्वाडिलेटरल क्वाडिलेटरल प्रोग्राम which was started in the year 2000 2001 and it runs through the state of ap from it starts from kolkata and odisha next andhra pradesh and tamil nadu so earlier it was called as nh5 we are seeing that and national highway 16 is a part of golden quadrilateral program 2000 2001 so in this this is means integration of all major four metropolitan or cosmopolitan cities of india integrating or merging or connecting hmm, like delhi mumbai chennai and kolkata so means uh, what highways do connect this one is we have seen one is national highway 16 another one is like four four two and eight so this is a connecting of integrating of national highways a 2 4 and 16 you can uh, think like this 2 4 8 16 16 okay all divisible by uh, all uh, 2 and this the longest segment is chennai and kolkata national highway it exactly national highway 16 starts from uh, Bahadgura Bahadgura in West Bengal it's near to Kolkata and travels to Chennai so where it starts from Bahadgura in uh, Kolkata near to Kolkata see it starts nearly Bahadgura in Kolkata and travels till Chennai this is national highway 16 it's a part of golden quadrilateral program which was started in 2000 and 2001 uh, what is mean by golden quadrilateral program means integrating all the major uh, cosmopolitan uh, cities of india from all the uh, directions and all that this thing and next it uh, runs parallel to the coast of andhra pradesh covering almost all the coastal districts of uh, andhra pradesh like all the major what are the major cities Uh, run through national highway 16 nh 16 are from shrikakulam to uh, nellore are we have seen already this okay so see, this highway forms a part of golden quadrilateral project undertaken by national highways development project and this is a part of even ah 45 ah 45 means asian highways we'll come to that but listen to it of asian highway network even this national highway 16 is not only the part of uh, um, golden quadrilateral even this is a part of ah 
एह फोर्टी फाइव ओके सो दिस इज अबाउट अवर नेशनल हाईवे सिक्सटीन वॉट आर दर मेजर नेशनल हाईवे विच रन थ्रू अ स्टेट कनेक्टिंग विथ सिटीज टू बिग सिटीज ओके आफ्टर नेशनल हाईवे एन एच सिक्सटीन अनदर वन इज एन एच फोर्टी फोर एन एच फोर्टी फोर earlier it was called as nh7 this is the longest highway in india not only andhra pradesh kadu india lone ati podavaina national highway edi ante nh7 paata dete dan kotta peru number nh44 it starts from shrinagar shrinagar in jammu kashmir to kanyakumari in tamil nadu okay so it runs it this even covers our uh, state it runs parallel uh, it uh, even run, runs in our andhra pradesh so national highway 44 is another important uh, national highway this is the longest in india but not in andhra pradesh longest national highway in andhra pradesh is nh16 but longest in india is nh44 or nh7 does it run through uh, ap yes longest uh, highway of india runs through ap but this is not the longest in andhra pradesh okay it runs from shrinagar to kanyakumari it is the longest national highway in the country in ap it it travels or it runs through which cities or which districts okay in ap it runs through karnool anantapur and penugonda it runs through all these three major places karnool anantapur and penugonda national highway uh, 44 or 7 runs through only these major these uh, particular cities karnool anantapur ante national highway 44 it somewhat runs like this ilaga National Highway it is NH forty four. That is NH sixteen. So, uh, apart from National Highway sixteen and forty four, what are the other national highways run through a state of Andhra Pradesh? Are we intending the National Highway sixty five? That is National Highway nine. Are you aware? Mundu. So, that is Machli Patnam. नीचे पुणे कनेक्ट अटे नाशनल हाईवे सिक्सटी फाइव अन्ट दिन पात नंबर नाशनल हाईवे नईन इधे मछिपट नीचे पुणे कनेक्टे नाशनल हाईवे इधर हाईवे मन आंध्र प्रदेश नीचे मन आंध्र प्रदेश नीचे वो नैक्स्ट इंकोटे नाशनल हाईवे एन आफ फोर्टी एन आर् फारटी इधे प्लेस नीचे वो अटे कर्नूल कड़प एंड चितूर Kannur, Kadapa, and Chetur. So, National Highway 18 and 40. It runs through which uh, uh, places? Which cities means Kannur, Kadapa, and Chetur. So, which district has uh, most number of highways? Maximum number of highways. Chetur is a district which has maximum number of highways. Ante Chetur jilla loni ekko highways mane ki kanpistain mata. Ante atu Bangalore niche. Uh, तरवा नाशनल हाईवे नईन का तरवा अद सारी नाशनल हाईवे एन का इला रकर नाशनल हाईवेज चितूर मी पार्लर एक्व मैक्सीम नंबर आफ् हाईवे कवर्ड रा थ्रू डिस्ट्रिक्ट आफ् चितूर एंड नैक्स्ट इज विशाखपट मैं इंदा चूसा विशाखपट नाशनल हाईवे सिक्सटी अदे अर्स्ट वेल नाशनल हाईवे फाइव सो इलाग एक्व नाशनल हाईवे ए डिस्ट्रिक्सो एक्व नाशनल हाईवे मन की चूड़ी अंत और चितूर फस्ट मोदी चितूर जिले तरवा विशाखपट नैक्स्ट कम टू पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट सो वी हव सीन पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट सो आंध्र प्रदेश पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट रोड वेस पब्लिक ट्रांसपोर्ट अटे अंदर की गुर्तोचे एपीएसआरटीसी आंध्र प्रदेश स्टेट रोड ट्रांसपोर्ट कॉर्पोरेशन सो लैक् कोई दी मैं हिस्ट एपीएसआरटी हिस्टरी सारी चूदा मन 
సో వెన్ లైక్ బ్రిటిష్ ఇండియా ఉండేటప్పుడు సో ఎట్ ద టైమ్ ఆఫ్ బ్రిటిష్ రూల్ హైదరాబాద్ వాజ్ రూల్డ్ బై హైదరాబాద్ వాజ్ అ ప్రిన్స్లీ స్టేట్ రూల్డ్ బై నిజామ్స్ అనమాట నిజామ్స్ సో ఈ హైదరాబాద్ ఇన్ దిస్ ఇన్ దిస్ నిజాం కాన్స్టిట్యున్సీ ఓ నిజాం స్టేట్ ఓ ప్రిన్స్లీ స్టేట్ అదర్ పార్ట్స్ వర్ రూల్డ్ బై బ్రిటిషర్స్ ప్రొవిన్సెస్ దే ఆర్ కాల్డ్ ప్రొవిన్సెస్ బట్ హైదరాబాద్ వాజ్ ఎ ప్రిన్స్లీ స్టేట్ సో ఇట్ కవర్డ్ ఈవెన్ మహారాష్ట్ర సమ్ పార్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ మహారాష్ట్ర సమ్ పార్ట్స్ ఆఫ్ కర్ణాటక అండ్ ద ప్రెజెంట్ హైదరాబాద్ తెలంగాణ సో వాట్ బ్రిటిష్ హ్యావ్ డన్ లైక్ నిజాం యూస్ టు హ్యావ్ ఎ హ్యావ్ ఇట్స్ ఓన్ రైల్వేస్ అండ్ రోడ్వేస్ ద కింగ్ నిజాం యూస్ టు హ్యావ్ ఓన్ రైల్వేస్ అండ్ రోడ్వేస్ దోస్ ఆర్ కాల్ నిజాం రైల్ రోడ్ ట్రాన్స్పోర్ట్ డెవలప్మెంట్ కార్పొరేషన్ okay they used to run their own railways and roadways oh after independence after independence nizams were re- hyderabad state was reluctant to join in the uh, indian union so you know that the history all like operation uh, polo and all so after that what happened no india like andhra pradesh andhra state was in the province of is was in the province of uh, madras so after andhra state was bifurcated or divided got a separate status from madras state it became andhra state after including nizam uh, hyderabad state also in 1956 it became andhra pradesh means the present andhra pradesh and the state of telangana okay so what happened no in 1958 jan 11th this nizam railroad transport development corporation uh, was obviously when uh, after it became state it uh, nizam st- hyderabad state merged into indian union it uh, obviously it uh, but it continued for some time but when andhra state was formed in 1956 what happened in 1958 this nizam uh, railroad transport corporation was turned into apsrtc andhra pradesh state road transport corporation that is the history and the background of the apsrtc but after 2000 in 2014 when telangana state was bifurcated from andhra pradesh again TSRTC and APSRTC two uh, road transport corporations was formed and from 2016 onwards it is continuing to be the APSRTC Andhra Pradesh state do have exclusively APSRTC that is Andhra Pradesh state road transport corporation this is the background or history of the APSRTC so it was formed in APSRTC was established on 1958 Jan 11th Jan 11th so as of like okay APSRTC is the biggest fleet of it has has the biggest fleet of buses which do uh, transport people uh, from many states and districts and rural places to other places even so we uh, according to 2017 APSRTC had a total of 11918 buses it's a fleet of with 970 bus shelters we do have bus shelters 970 bus shelters all over the state in 11918 buses shelters and connecting over 14000 villages in over 3000 routes APSRTC connects 14000 villages in over 3000 different different routes okay it does have 11900 fleet of buses so this was about our ap uh, transportation thank you